Comedian Kenan Thompson said Monday that the cast and crew of Saturday Night Live found themselves being held hostage by rapper Kanye West during a pro-Donald Trump speech he gave after the show this weekend. We're all entitled to our opinions, Thompson said of West's post-show monologue during an appearance on Late Night with Seth Meyers Monday night. I don't know if that's the moment, necessarily, to hold people hostage like that, but hey. Though Thompson said he was not on stage during West's speech, he said he was able to witness the Chicago rapper Kaka on People that night. As soon as he said, hey, join me up on stage, everybody, I was like, oh, there goes the little cheese in the mousetrap. It's going down, Thompson said. Thompson said he opted to leave the stage early so he could catch the rapper's final musical performance on screen. I felt so bad for those guys, Thompson said. Because it's hard to stand there and not be able to debate somebody who's going so far against your personal opinion. It's so many times that I talk to a white person about this and they say, how could you support Trump? He's racist. Well if I was concerned about racism, I would have moved out of America a long time ago, West said during part of his non-televised speech on Saturday. We don't just make our decisions off of racism. Imma break it down to you right now, if someone inspires me and I connect with them, I don't have to believe in all-day policies," West continued. West, who made the controversial comments off-air during the show's credits, has drawn a whirlwind of criticism for being vocal in his support for the president. Earlier this year, the rapper praised Trump in a series of tweets, saying that the president was his brother because the two are both dragon energy. Trump later thanked West for his support and said it was very cool 